Cal Kellogg here. On September 30th, Paul Neeland and I, along with Alex Brower of BDC Advertising, headed up to the Sacramento River to chase King Salmon with Master Guide Mark Blayett. One of our goals was to test the new hognose flatfish. So Mark took us to one of his favorite areas on the river and we started pulling plugs early in the morning. This place is called uh, Iron Canyon. It's uh, below Jelly's Ferry Bridge. It's my favorite place. There's this considered two rocks. Uh, you can see Mount Lassen back there. The plugs looked great, but the salmon just weren't interested, so we headed downstream to try our hands at fishing row, and it didn't take long for our move to pay off. Fighting a big old salmon feels like. Had it on for about five or minutes or so, and sucked on a sucked in a big chunk of row. You want to tell us a nice long story while you're getting that fish in? <laughs> I'm nervous. <laughs> I want to see it. We gotta get them in before the waterfall down here. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it, 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 <laughs> it's great having salmon back in the Sacramento River again. Now, this is probably the first salmon I've hooked in six years or so on the river in California. So, this is awesome. A lot of people I don't think thought they'd ever see fishing like this in the river again. Oh, he's pretty big. Is he? Yeah. yeah good sized fish. <laughs> oh, what a nice fish. Okay, swing him over here. Well hooked. Just take your time. Just bring him over here. It's another hand. Looks like a male, but it's a girl. I got the first fish of the day, and then it was Paul's turn. That's a chill. Is it really? Yep. That's a girl fish. Don't, don't come around very often. Mark had mainly been catching bucks, so he was excited to put some hens in the boat to replenish his supply of roe. Right after putting Paul's fish in the box, I hooked up again. Oh, Good. Oh, there we go. Ooh, nice shiny. Yeah. Right when we need you. There you go. Bead almost to the rod. The bead on that dropper. Okay, that's good. Stop right there and lift slowly. Well hooked. The Sacramento had been producing big numbers of jacks, so I was really pleased with this 20 plus pound hen. Paul hooked up next. We got there, Paul. Another Sacramento River salmon. What'd you catch that one on? It's on row. Right. Lay hut row. Lay hut row. <laughs> Not quite as big as the last two, I don't think. We've heard that before. Yeah. They stay down there, though, that's for sure. They do like to stay down on the bottom. These fish fight really good. Absolutely. Considering there's not a lot of river to go down in, they stay down. They're heavy. Well, the the interesting thing is, I guess Mark's done this a time or two because he said we wouldn't start getting them till the sun was high, and he was right. I don't have them every day, but that's been the trend lately. So, what's your average been per day, Mark? Um, I've been getting limits every day, but we've had a lot of jacks, so we've been catching a lot. I put a couple jacks in the box to make sure fishing's good, and then I start trading up fish. So you've been fishing mostly row these days? That's all I've been using, particularly row. Sometimes flat fish early in the morning. Okay. Oh, and what's your big fish this season so far? Jeez, woo, look at him go. That's your little fish, Paul. I know, he woke <laughs> up. He, he grew. Ah, uh, 35 or so. I haven't seen, I've only seen two fish that are, you know, over 35. I think Scott Kenyon got a 38 or a 40. Are you through playing around? Yeah. It's another girl. Nice fish. I'll take her. 
we got one boy today. Is that you gonna right? make it that? No. You gonna make it really hard? Where is it? He's got it down in the gullet somewhere, huh? Fought that one another five minutes. It'd be coming out the other side. Paul Nealon, king of the belly hookers. <laughs> Hey, you got him in the boat. That's what matters. That's what counts. That's Excellent. What Beautiful fish. <laughs> that is a nice fish. I don't care about it. That's a beauty, yeah. What a day we've had in the Sacramento River. We've got seven or eight fish of this caliber. Just an awesome day. Big hands. Never thought we'd see fish like this again in the Sacramento. It's great. They're back. With seven kings ranging from eight to 24 pounds in the box, we called it a day and Mark motored us back up to Jelly's Ferry. We had a great time fishing with Mark. He's got an in-depth knowledge of the river and a relaxed, kickback manner that really makes for a fun day on the water.